Hey everyone, if you've been following me for a while, you know I'm obsessed with push-ups. I love the simplicity, just you and the floor. No equipment or gym is needed. But doing the same old push-up routine stops working after a while. You hit a plateau where no matter how hard you try, you can't increase your max reps. I've tested countless push-up programs over the years. Most add complexity with different hand positions or unstable surfaces. But that misses the point. The beauty of push-ups is their simplicity. So I developed a back-to-basics approach focused on doing regular push-ups better. The result? I doubled my max push-ups in just 10 days. Seriously. I went from struggling to do 25 push-ups to pumping out 50. And I'm no spring chicken either. I'm 42 years old. So this program works at any age. Intrigued? I'll walk you through exactly what I did so you too can rapidly increase your push-up count. No equipment is required and it takes just 10-15 minutes per day. Let's dive in. 1. Warm up properly. Most people dive right into push-ups cold. Big mistake. You need to warm up your shoulders, chest, and triceps to prevent injury and prime your muscles for what's coming. Spend 5 minutes doing arm circles, shoulder rotations, and body weight rows. Do a few sets of inclined push-ups to get blood flowing to your upper body. Resist the urge to jump straight to regular push-ups when you're still cold. 2. Perfect your form. Bad form is one of the biggest reasons people plateau with push-ups. Their hips sag, back hunches, and range of motion is limited. Sloppy form not only limits your strength gains, but can lead to wrist, elbow, and shoulder injuries down the road. Focus on keeping your core engaged and body in a straight line from head to toe. Go down until your elbows are at a 45 degree angle then drive back up. Wrists should stack below your shoulders. Do push-ups in front of a mirror if needed to check form. Quality over quantity here. 3. Use resistance bands. One of the best ways to overload your muscles is to add resistance bands. Loop a band around your upper back and grab the handles. The extra resistance makes push-ups significantly harder, forcing your muscles to adapt. Start with a light band giving 10-20 pounds of extra resistance. As you get stronger, use heavier bands up to 40-50 pounds resistance. This simple trick allows you to make push-ups harder without having to go deeper. Game changer. 4. Do explosive push-ups. Explosive push-ups build power and strength by generating momentum. As you drive upwards, try to lift your hands off the floor. Clap if able. Land softly with control and then lower down again. Explosive push-ups activate your fast twitch muscle fibers unlike traditional push-ups. Start with just 5 reps mixed into your regular sets. Over time work your way up to 10 reps. Be careful not to sacrifice form by going too fast. 5. Use upper body weights. Holding dumbbells or placing weighted plates on your upper back is another way to progress. Start light such as 5 pounds dumbbells or a 10 pounds plate. Increasing the load forces your muscles to work harder. Adjust the weight so you can complete your desired representative range while maintaining proper form. Too heavy and your form will break down. Shoot for 3-5 sets of 6-10 reps with added weight. This is a great plateau busting technique. 6. Elevate your feet. Elevating your feet on a box, bench, or Swiss ball increases the difficulty by reducing support. Your shoulders and chest have to work harder to lift your body weight. Start with your feet on the floor, then gradually increase the height as you get stronger. An adjustable step is ideal to allow smooth progression. Go as high as needed to reach muscle failure in your target representative range. 7. Do close grip push-ups. Normal push-up hand position is shoulder width apart. Moving your hands closer together activates your triceps more. Rotate in close grip sets along with regular push-ups. Start with hands 2-3 inches apart. As you get stronger, place them directly under your shoulders so your index fingers and thumbs touch. This advanced narrow push-up position really hammers your triceps. 8. Try decline push-ups. Decline push-ups are done with your hands elevated on a box or bench and feet on the floor. This shifts your body weight forward, increasing the resistance. Stick with normal push-ups until you can do 30 plus reps before advancing to decline. Start with a low box or bench so your body is angled around 30 degrees. Go higher as you get stronger up to about 45 degrees. Decline push-ups build serious upper body pushing strength. Use them wisely in your routine. 9. Do push-up pyramids. For pyramid sets do one push-up, rest for 15-30 seconds, two push-ups, rest again, and continue increasing reps up to 5-10 before winding back down. Go as high as you can while maintaining perfect form. Pyramids build muscle endurance and are deceivingly brutal. Shoot for 3-5 total pyramids in a session after your normal push-up sets. 
I like to do them at the end of my workout as a finisher exercise when I'm already fatigued. Killer. 10. Allow proper recovery. This plan has you doing a ton of push-ups across multiple techniques. That's great for driving rapid increases in strength and muscle growth. But you need to balance that training stress with adequate recovery. Be sure to take at least one full rest day between push-up training to allow your body to recharge. Get 7-9 hours of sleep per night. Eat enough protein and calories to fuel muscle growth. Neglect recovery and you'll quickly plateau again. There you have it 10 advanced tips to rapidly increase your push-up count in just 10 days. I hope this gives you some new ideas to shock your muscles and bust through plateaus. Let me know which techniques work best for you. And stay tuned for more killer bodyweight training content coming soon. Now it's your turn. Try my 10-day push-up challenge for yourself and report back with your results. I can't wait to hear how much you're able to increase your max.